Hey guys, it's Kazmir, and we just got back out to the shed, stitched ourselves up, and a walker attacked, and now they're bringing me inside, I guess, because I can kill a walker, I can pull my own weight now. So I guess we'll see what they say. They're going to look over Clem's arm. Let's -a go. Might hurt a little. How she look? Her suturing skills need some work, but otherwise, I say she should be fine. So it wasn't a lurker bite? If it was, the fever would have already set in, and her temperature would be through the roof. And that guy's got some issues. The one in the black shirt. Considered you a threat, which you were. Maybe you still are. No, I'm not. We put you in that shed out of concern for the safety of our loved ones. And then you escaped and persuaded my daughter to steal from us. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. But there are a few things you need to know about my daughter. Okay. She isn't like you. You may not get that initially. But once you're around her for a while, you'll understand. She knew how bad the world is. What it's really like out there. She would cease to function. She's my little girl. She's all I had left. And I would ask that you stay away from her. But we're besties now. She needs to grow up sometime. You do not know what she needs. Rebecca was worried you might be working with someone else. That your being here was no accident. I guess we'll find out. But one thing I know for sure, you are not to be trusted. Stay away from my daughter. We're besties, bro. <laughs> hey, uh, brought you some food if you're hungry. We pinky swore in everything. Gotta be wary of everyone. That's what I was saying earlier. I get it. <laughs> so, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I don't know. I'm kind of on my own now. Well, you're welcome to stay here. You can let yourself heal up. 
take some time to sort things out. Do you think everyone else will be okay with it? They'll just have to deal with it. So, what happened to your parents? If you don't mind me asking. I mean, I assume what happened to them is what happened to just about everyone's parents. You're just so young. Didn't think you could have made it on your own for so long, but maybe you did. Other people took care of me, if that's what you're asking. I was just curious on how you made it this far. I just tried to stay with good people and not do anything dumb. Hey, I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't have asked. went on vacation and left me with a babysitter. And they never came back. We went to Savannah to find them. But they were already dead. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. This man found me and took care of me. We met up with other survivors and we all tried to make it. It didn't work. His name was Lee. He taught me how to survive. He told me to stay away from cities. What uh, happened to him? I like those two. Even though he dropped her. You're still here. I wouldn't be comfortable if I were you. <laughs> Whose baby is it? Let's not be too hostile. They're letting me use the meds. They gave me a bed. They're feeding me. Just whatever she's got going on with whoever guy she's got it going on with, that can be her business. How you holding up? I heard you got an earful from Rebecca last night. Once she gets going, there's no bringing her back. Her bark's worse than her bite. She's all talk. She doesn't scare me. She was in a mood last night, that's for sure. How far are these fish traps? It ain't much further. Anyone teach you how to shoot? By that I mean taught proper. Any idiot with a finger can shoot. Yeah, but not a rifle. Well, that makes sense. Less kick. This thing would probably knock you on your ass. Nick was about your age. First time I took him hunting. Came across this beautiful 13-point buck just standing there on the ridge line. The boy takes the rifle. He lines up the shot just like I taught him, and then I hear him start whining. He turns to me and he says, I can't do it. I can't shoot it, Uncle Pete. Please don't make me shoot it. 
Really? No way. Hey! Why didn't you wait? You want us standing around while you piss on a tree? You know where the river is, boy. Anyway, so I grab the gun out of his hand before the big buck runs off, when bang, the gun fires. The boy nearly gut shot me, and of course the buck gets away. What are you going and telling her this shit for? Because you almost blew her face off yesterday. Seems relevant. <laughs> Trying to let her know it's nothing personal with you. <laughs> you just got a record. Me a hard time. Because you're always giving everyone else a hard time. I apologized already. She accepted. Okay, well, I didn't know that. It's fine. He apologized. You're always trying to embarrass me. You're doing a good enough job of that on your own. Okay, let's stop fighting. Leaving us again. I know where the fucking river is. Let's just love each other, guys. Our time is short. <laughs> so anyway, I found that buck later that season. Shot it right in the neck. Brought it up to my sister's figuring she'd want to freeze some of the meat. Nick didn't speak to me for weeks. Sometimes you gotta play a role. Even if it means people you love hate you for it. You should tell him that. Uncle Pete! Oh boy. Nick! Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Ah, full of holes. Who do you think did this? Not sure yet, but it ain't your average gang of thugs. That much I know. Think about it. You're Carver. What do you do? Who's Carver? Check those guys there. Be careful. Some of them might still be moving. That leather jacket looks familiar. I want to look at this one right here. Yeah, it's what's his name, isn't it? This one's shot too. Through the head? Yeah. Check the rest. And look for ammo. We're running low. I think it's that one guy from the gas station. Was that his leather jacket? Let me know what you guys think. out of here gotta check the rest what why calm down and think about it son calm down we gotta get out of here now jesus christ get a hold of yourself nick's right this doesn't look good no it don't but one of these folks might still be alive and they might just be inclined to tell us who did this we gotta do this now stay here keep searching these this is a dumb idea you know nick i don't like this either but sooner or later, you're going to have to realize a simple truth. What, that you're an asshole? That nobody in this world is ever going to give a goddamn whether you like something or not. You've got to grow up, son. Whatever. Come on, Clem. You want to be useful? Keep a lookout on that tree line. Whoever did this might still be out there, waiting for another sucker to stumble across this mess, just like baiting a fish. I'm on it. You always so agreeable? No. Good. It'll fit right in with this outfit. Look, just keep your head on straight. Same deal. Pretty shot to pieces. Hope this isn't anyone you know. No. Good. Damn it. More on that side. You check out these ones. See if there's anything on them that'll tell us who they were.
Is that Krista? Kind of looks like Krista, doesn't it? With her purple sweater or whatever. Is that her backpack? Did you get bit? Burgers! I'm out of ammo! Up this way! Bitch! Damn it! You get your asses over here, both of I'll you! Cover you! Oh gosh! We gotta get out of here! Get over here, goddammit! Can't you listen to me once? Just one time? I've got ammo! Come on! Come on! Jesus! Oh no! Help him! You said you had ammo. Hold on. Run. God damn it. Nick. We have to go. Oh boy. Right, and that's the end of episode one. Uh, so here's our choices. Yes. 50 40 split on if they save, help save, uh, or help try to help uh, Krista. But you know she's okay. I thought I thought she was laying dead there in the river. That looked like a Krista to me, but maybe not. Yeah, it's 50 50. I can kill him, the dog. A little more, a little more people killed the dog. It was not like I was like, oh, it's a dog, let's kill it. It was the guy, the dog was laying there impaled. He was in pain. He wasn't going to make it. So you just let him just sit there and suffer? You may as well put him out of his misery. And I want them beans, dang it. It was completely vindictive. I just killed him because I wanted my beans back. Yep. Yep. You hear it here first, guys. Kesmir hates dogs. 50-50 here, too. It seems like it's split down the middle. Goodness. Yeah, that, I figured that would be the unpopular choice. But, you know, whatever. And 60% uh, went with Pete. Okay. Yeah, yeah, he seems like he's got a better head on him, but we're gonna have to lop off that leg if he's bit. He's limping, and I saw red red stuff. Looks like he got bit. So I don't know if we will, we'll, we'll be able to uh, save him or not. All right. There you go. That was episode one. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in episode two. Kesmir out.